This is the Bitax Gamma 601 from Power Mining. Right in the front, you're going to notice that display right on the top there. We'll see that on in just a little bit. It also has this wireless card right here to connect to your wireless internet. When I turn it on its side, you're going to see that massive heat sink and fan combo because underneath all of that is an ASIC chip. That ASIC chip is doing all the work it needs to mine Bitcoin. And in doing that work, it's going to use electricity, which generates heat. And that's where this combo gets all of that heat far away from that chip so it can operate on peak performance. You're also going to see its AC inlet right on the side there, USB-C to connect to your computer. And then finally, when I go on the other side of the heatsink, you're going to see two buttons that are boot and reset. Connecting the BitAx to power for the first time. Let's take a look. Fan spun up for a second. All right, fans on. And we have some information on the display here, which is for Wi-Fi setup, connect to the network bitax underscore zero three ED. Let's see if I have that. Yep, there it is on my phone. We're gonna tap that to connect and let's see. Okay, so we've got a captive Wi-Fi portal opening. Oh, and this is where I can just enter in the Wi-Fi SSID for my network, which is just the name of your local wireless network. So I'm gonna enter mine in here. And then you can just enter the password that you would enter to connect to that. So let me enter mine in. And we're gonna hit save and restart. Looks like we successfully connected over to my wireless network and we're about to be up and mining.